Right, here we are again with the Traveller after our last loss in the trees. I think I've got the video working better now as you can probably see hopefully on there. Um, earthing problems with my circuitry. So I'm going to attempt to do an FPV flight this time and hope that I don't have to use return to home because I'm not altogether trusting of it. I think the Sigla Max has some inherent issue because it for some reason stops me getting much control of the elevator in the downward direction. Right, that's not stabilised and that's fine. But if I put it into stabilised, that's up and that's down. That's as much down as I've got. Doesn't matter what rates I use, that's it. And I don't understand why. Right, stabilise. That should be altitude and heading hold. promising and then this should be uh, return to home and that's what I don't like look at the amount of elevator it's throwing in there of course when it hits return to home it just dives into the sky well, not dives climbs onto its tail and then stops stalls and then drops out the sky so let's hope we don't have that scenario Glides nice anyway. It glides beautifully, but it didn't sound right. There you go, that's another scenario. Don't fly with a prop on the wrong way round, or possibly even two on the wrong way round. Better. Well, I don't know what happened there, but return to home saved it. Um, it's in hide at the moment. Proper FPV in it today. Quite steady and then just coming along there he must have flicked it into 
I did. I put it into return to home and it, because it went into a, just now I was cruising along quite nicely and suddenly it went into a bloody spiral dive and I just flicked a switch and I heard it rev up and it came out of it and sorted itself out and I realised I flicked, accidentally flicked return to home. Oh. And so return to home did something. So I mean, when it, it went into spiral dive was that just... Uh... I, I don't know why it did it. <laughs> I'm not sure. I mean, there is a bit of headwind up there and I perhaps was going a bit slow. Is that your knee stroke? Yeah. Because I, uh, I thought I finally, I struggled to find them actually. And then eventually found them in a... Yeah, they're bloody good stuff. value. I think they're actually a tad, well, I think they might be a tad bright. Well, that's quite light there. And yeah. That's so I've got my uh, FPV's working yeah. fine now. It was all the earthing problem. So have you got any pan and tilt or are you just... No, just I've got pan. Okay. Um, I think it's a, really nice. Careful. Over there. Oh yeah. When I first launched it, it went off nicely, but I had no right turn. It was just going straight on full right i was just imagining to just go straight and I'll, but it's definitely better for mind you i haven't i'm not bothering to try it unstabilized to be fair i mean it just you're just looking quiet there actually, isn't it? yeah so it's not it's pitching up but it isn't pitching up well, it's not flat out, but it's not. Yeah. It's climbing just on throttle, obviously. Yeah, yeah. But then, but then. I'll be interested to see your um, angle of your motors, man. Right, quite a lot, actually. A lot more than he yeah. said, anyway. I, I'm, I'm fairly sure there's an issue with this tail, you know. So you. Yeah. yeah. Just come up. I've got my tail taped. <coughs> okay. Does make it more rigid. Yeah. So when it did a spin, was it was it any? Well, it was fortunately quite high. Um, I was just in stabilised mode. I'm really not sure quite why it did it. It's just it's not thing, it's a thing, isn't it? Eventually going to fly over the sea. I know, but I mean, it's quite relieved to see that the. Um, I don't know whether it would always work, but the fact that the um, return to home seemed to bring it out of it. Yeah. It might have been because I got too much up elevator and it was trying to fight it or, or something, I don't know. So it's still your... Uh, oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Oop, oop. So it's, did you see what, yeah, what happened there? Because it, it just suddenly it seemed to, to drop a wing, it seemed. Yeah. But at that, that time, I just steered it out of it. Yeah. You say if you... God, those lights are bright, actually. You can see them quite clearly from here. <laughs> well, it's the. So okay. it's only doing 17 miles an hour there, so there is a headwind there. <clears throat> yeah. It is the fucking toughest plane I think we've ever oh, had. Oh, they are tough, that's for sure. I mean, it's not just chance, because they've both had a fucking right hammering. Okay, I'll come down and go. Right, I think I'm going to qu quit while the going's good with that one. I've got the um, 
I've got the uh, drifter now. Uh, I'm quite keen to see how that goes with the uh, other one in it. That's still